Hello and welcome to Bee Monster Laboratory. We're back today with another STEM toy review. Today we're looking at a product called Mechanics Cams and Cranks. It's distributed by Elenco here in the U.S. It has won several awards for education, creativity, and fun. This product will allow you to build eight functional cams and cranks, including a drawbridge, an oil pump, a fishing crane, a sewing machine, all while discovering how these mechanisms are important in everyday machinery. It looks like a lot of fun. Let's go build it and check it out. This product is brand new and this is a building kit that teaches you how uh, the mechanics of cams and cranks work. It comes with uh, instructions inside the box but it also has instructions you can access online if you'd rather do that. It's made in Cyprus, EU. Apparently it's an international product. Like I said, it was it's distributed by Elenco here in the U.S. for ages 8 to 8 and up, I guess. Um, so printed instructions and online instructions. Here are some of the items that you can build. You can build a fishing crane that looks like the oil pump, a uh, moving figure, sewing machine, a uh, moving bridge. That's a drawbridge. An eagle with flapping wings. On the back, it uh, it has some pictures of uh, some of the items that you can build, like the sewing machine, or the oil pump, or the fishing crane, a moving figure, an eagle with flapping wings. Uh, it looks like fun while also educational. So let's go ahead and open it up and check it out. I do like to open it up um, on on video, so that anybody that, that may purchase this used will we'll know if they have a full item, you know, a complete set or not. So I'll go ahead and open this up and cut the tape here. Here and here. And we'll see what they got here. We'll dump it out. That's all that's in there. We'll set the set the box aside here. So here are the instructions. Looks like a fairly thick book. It's got 34 pages. It's got a list of all your materials that, that, that are complete in the set. So if you have all those materials there, then you have a complete set, it looks like. It has the different figures that you can build. Looks like it's pretty detailed. It looks like fun. It does look very educational as well. And it comes with one, two, three, four bags and this guy right here. So this is all that's in the box. We'll go ahead and get started. I'll check it out. Probably play with it a little bit. There's even a quiz at the end at the back of the book it looks like. Um, there's a couple exercises to quiz you. There's some experiments. Um, it's pretty cool. And and over here there are the awards that it, this this particular item has has won in the past. This definitely is not a new item, but uh, definitely pretty cool. And it goes through all the different uh, pieces of machinery that it does have cams and cranks, and shows you how this item relates to those machines. So. All right, well, we will get started building. But I think first I'm gonna actually play around with this. Well, I'm back and I tried to build a fishing crane. It didn't quite work out because I ran out of these pieces right here. Um, so on the fishing crane, I got down to about right here, which is halfway. And after that, I ran out of these little pieces and I couldn't connect uh, these two structures and then which in turn you connect them to the other four or five pieces that you build so it just couldn't come together unfortunately but uh, and I didn't know what what the deal was so I flipped back here to the um, the bill of materials page here I'm so I'm supposed to have 17 of these blocks with the attachment tabs on the side of the two and uh, it turns out I only have 12 so Unfortunately, I couldn't build that one. I'll see if I can build one of the other items. I'm having a feeling that I'm not going to be able to. 
But, uh, and, you know, I'll check and see the sewing machine or that, you know, the oil pump. It looks like they all use most of the items. So, unfortunately, I couldn't do that. But, um, and I'm going to put a smiley face on this uh, purchase and go ahead and tell you what I think about the pieces as it is, as I was working with them. They seem to be constructed very well. They're very durable. And they snap together. So one side of the the block looks like that. The other side looks like that. You can snap them in both both sides. This, If you snap them in this side right here, you can twist it and it'll move and it's not coming out. Very solid, very durable, and they're very easy to remove. If you snap it in this side over here, it does not turn. It is locked in place. And like I said, they're, they're fairly easy to remove. You might come across one that's uh, they're kind of stubborn, kind of like me. Uh, <laughs> but um, so there's also a little uh, space right here for the tab on some of the blocks to fit in. And that's kind of interesting too. So that fits snugly in there. It is seated in there and is not coming out. And it does rotate as well. So, and it's also fairly easy to remove. So, and if it's not easy to remove, uh, you know, maybe you just play with it for a little bit. We'll, uh, we'll loosen it up some. But, um, you know, those are easy to remove. It's, it's, you know, they're good quality pieces. They're not, you can tell that they're not cheap junk. Um, I, I do like them. Some of the pieces have, I don't even know what you call these things, four little tabs on the side here. Uh, that do connect some of the bigger pieces together so and then the ones that I'm missing I'm missing five of these which is a lot uh, in my opinion but you know one or two you know you might be able to build some of the the items but missing your five um, that, that's quite a few but anyway these smaller blocks have the same kind of opening here and then here so Here's a block with just a, a little pocket there to, to hold one of these. So you snap it on like that right there. And then that ro rotate as well. And then to remove them, pretty easy. And then here's a little bit bigger of a block. Same type of uh, design. It's got one little tab and then that little pocket to, to connect it to another bigger block. And then you've got these uh, bigger blocks here, which you can connect five uh, blocks around that. Uh, these were pretty cool. So this is a, there's a tab on, on the end of this, as you can see as I'm turning it around. And you fit this in here and you lock it into place. If I can, there we go and you lock it into place if you can see those little holes right there so you slide it in to the third or fourth position you twist it I twist it it usually makes a snap sound but it did not but it's locked into place pretty neat system of, um, of building and, and locking mechanisms and stuff uh, you got these little tabs here you've got uh, you've got a rope it's a flexible band uh, here's your rope for the pulleys I wasn't able to put any of the pulleys together. Uh, it also comes with uh, two handles here. And then you put your little uh, bars in there and connect it with a handle here. And then you would do your crank. Um, now there's a hook here as well. So yeah, I'm, unfortunately I'm not able to show the, the fishing crane. I thought it was one of the cooler uh, items here. I think the sewing machine looks pretty neat as well. So, moving on to the book, here are a bunch of other items that they sell. I did look those up online. They look pretty neat. To me, especially the gears and worm drives look, look pretty neat. And then the pulley drives. And over here you can see the awards that they've won for uh, educational toys and, and best product. But anyway, the table of contents, you can read about the history of the cams and cranks. It'll uh, give you like little simple equations for torque and pictures and these little did you know areas are, are neat it'll give you a little bit of facts and history 
they show you drawings and uh, there's your uh, torque equation and it just it explains how torque works as it pertains to cams and cranks so that's neat and then there's an experiment section in this book as well and that's right here it says right here discover the crank mechanism you know what is a crank mechanism and the relationship between handle position and the force applied um, so you learn stuff like that and over here's a quiz if you thought you're going to get away with this without a quiz <laughs> you're you're sorely mistaken because here is a quiz everybody loves to be quizzed on what they learn you got a, a couple quizzes in here and then you've got the building instructions what I like about the building instructions is that it's so simple to follow so first you'd make this section up here it tells you exactly where the pieces go it gives you arrows to where you're going to plug them into other pieces and what it's going to look like in the end so that's your first piece that's going to be your second piece right here that's going to be your third piece but uh, overall I think it's a great product I think they just missed five pieces and maybe the guy putting putting these pieces in the package fell asleep at the plant I don't know but like I said I wouldn't let that discourage me from from purchasing this again or purchasing any of these other products if you go online and look at these they all look very cool same types of blocks and pulleys and lever systems and stuff um, you know I think it's a solid product uh, you know if it's complete <laughs> it's a solid product so I went ahead and I looked at some of the other items to build the oil drill seems to use um, somewhere between 13 and 15 of those pieces that I don't have so I can't do that one uh, which would have been really neat and the, mu the moving figure it uses a lot more too than I have so unfortunately I can't do that one all these uh, structures that you can build use most of those pieces that I don't have so unfortunately I'm not gonna be able to do it not with this one so maybe I'll go out maybe I'll buy another maybe I'll buy another one of these and then I'll have enough pieces to do it well thank you all for watching if you enjoyed it don't forget to like it by clicking the thumbs up also share it with somebody else who may enjoy it or find it useful and don't forget to follow and we'll see you again next time see ya